The cleaners will thank me for this video. Rotten glasses and mirrors are shining. In a bowl, I will put 200 milliliters of water and also 50 milliliters of alcohol. Tell me if you've ever done some homemade trick with water and alcohol to help with house cleaning. I'd love to know. I'm sure you will be surprised by the final result of this tip. I'll add three tablespoons of detergent. Guys, do it at your house. And then come back here to tell me what you think. I'm sure you and your whole family will love it. That's the best way I've learned in my entire life to clean furniture and house glass. And before I forget, tell me which city you're watching so I can send you a special hug. Today's hug goes to Bridget Morgan from Germany. I'm glad you're enjoying our tips. Finally, I will add a tablespoon of furniture polish. I have no doubt that you will come back here to thank me for having taught you. I never again had to spend money on those expensive cleaning products sold in conventional markets. I doubt you've made any tips like this before. After mixing everything, I will transfer our liquid into a spray bottle. It will help control the amount we use in each application. This way, we won't spend it all at once. Even your friends will ask you to teach them how to make this amazing product. With only a few ingredients present, in everyday life, we can do a foolproof trick. No more wasting time rubbing those stains. Hard to get out of the furniture. This tip changed my life and will certainly change yours too. It's already gotten into my routine and it's definitely going into yours too. Simply apply a small amount of our mixture on top of the desired surface. Not even I believed how efficient it is. The first time I did it, after applying our after applying our mixture in the mirror, I will use a squeegee to remove excess liquid. You will realize that the mirror will be totally clean and free of dirt. I'm sure you've never cleaned the mirror in your house like that before. We can also use our product in furniture made of wood. In addition to moisturizing the wood, they acquire a much stronger shine. You won't regret trying it. With the help of a cloth, I will dry all the liquid that we apply on the furniture. That's the secret that even big stores use to keep their furniture shining like new. I hope you enjoyed this tip. Thank you so much for watching this video so far. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.